started. And now we are officially on. I'd like to call this meeting of the Board of Assessors uh, to order on Thursday, April 20th. It's now 9.09. And first item on the agenda is, hold on, I forget my. I just have two. Uh, on the minutes? I just have two minutes. I don't have an agenda. Is there an agenda? Yeah, no, I'm looking at my phone. Approved minutes of prior meeting. So we've got two sets of minutes in front of us. The uh, yeah. I'll be to release the, uh, I'm assuming the executive session minutes are public. Um, once we release them. The executive session minutes typically are kept confidential. Private until and, the adjudication. Correct. Public. Until everything that's on it is, is available to be publicly released. However, in this case, there's nothing confidential on it. So, okay. So, uh, first item is like to uh, like motion to accept the minutes of the open session for April 13th, 2023. I second the motion. Make the motion, then I'll second the motion. Motion is made and seconded. Uh, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Unanimous vote to do nothing. Uh, next item is approval of the executive session minutes for April 13th, 2023. Um, I have a motion to accept those minutes. So moved. So, so, so moved. So moved. Second. Uh, all in favor, say aye. 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 Unanimous vote. And the minutes are accepted. Item number two, update the board on appellate tax board cases, other negotiations, and settlements. So okay. yeah, I was just going to say we have a couple that are open, but you can speak to that one. Yeah. Um, there are no negotiations going on at this point um, for the cases we have. Both of them seem to be, I think the two in particular seem to be incorrect filings, and we're going to look into that. And uh, Incorrect filings on? By the oh. attorneys who filed for okay. the, uh, at the, the appellate, at the appellate tax board, but okay. we're going to so take a look two, at that. They're currently open. I believe it's two, 132 Evelyn and 201st. Um, and... You know, I don't have the list in front of me, but there's only a couple that are going to have hearings soon. I, I want to say three or four total. And one of them appears that there's, ATB has no jurisdiction, so we have to motion to dismiss it. Um, but we have work to do. So, yeah, there are no major negotiations. But nothing, yeah, way. nothing really to okay. report on that. Uh, anything else on item number two? Moved to item number three, review and or vote on abatement ex and exemption applications. Yes, and we have um, explained to you last week, there are a number of those that uh, are chapter 41A deferrals, where the taxpayer, if they meet certain requirements, can defer their all or part of their taxes. By statute. And, by statute. And uh, Nancy Martin upstairs reviews all these applications most of them are repeats. And again, there's a list for each of you here. Those are the repeats that she has reviewed and seen that they are in line. So basically all you need to do is, uh, is to vote on them. And I will- uh, I just, um, I'm, sure. Sure. I'm sorry. Um, so discuss these, we need to be in executive session. So oh, we haven't gone there yet. We sorry. haven't yet. Oh. Uh, so, uh, and if you want to jump ahead to schedule the next meeting and then go to executive session and then we can adjourn from there. Okay, um, we can do that. So so this, so number three really is, comes under executive session? Correct. Okay, yeah. so then we will put that aside and we'll go to number, what number four, general update and scheduling. So um, the scheduling would be for the next meeting. And what we'd like to be able to do, um, I can tell you that in order to schedule a meeting, we have multiple things that we have to do. So we have to check, the, make sure the room's available. We have to make sure Zoom is available. We make sure, make sure all the people are available. And then we have to post to um, town clerk, and that has to be done in a at least 48 hours, but the town clerk doesn't want to be dealing with it 48 hours. She wants it in 
more in advance. So having said all that, it would be really nice to be able to schedule a couple of meetings ahead. Um, I'd rather be in a position where we don't have business and cancel it as opposed to trying to scramble around to create it. Okay. So it would be really nice to schedule out two or three meetings, get them all posted and ready to go. And if we need to cancel, we can cancel. How many meetings reasonably do you anticipate we need to um, finish up the year? After these exemptions, we really don't have a lot. Two, really. Um, I told you last week about possible taxpayers who might want to contest their denial or that they weren't granted enough right. that will call. And we will normally schedule that for an evening, evening meeting oh, okay. at like five o'clock. Okay. Um, so they can, uh, they can, if they're working, they can work, um, okay. you know, not bring them in here at this point. But we haven't had any calls yet, but we still have a number of denials to go out so that people don't know yet that they've been denied. Could we offer up, for the if that happens, could we offer up a morning prior to an evening? Sure, we can. Uh, we got more convenient. Convenient town meeting uh, time as well. So. Yeah, well, this would probably be after town meeting. Town meeting is... Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So this wouldn't be until May. Later Usually it's May. May. Okay. Um, okay. Because the... Well, town meeting's first two weeks, as you know. Yeah, the letters will go out in the next two weeks. Okay. And, you know, we'll give them a couple of weeks to react to that. So if they're they're calling by the end of April, you know, we're looking for something in the first week of May. Oh, uh, well, right. first week of May is town meeting. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, first week of first June. week of June. First week of June. Okay. And that still gives them time to file at the appellate tax board if they're not happy with, um, you know, whatever your decision might be. Okay. Okay. Because normally they will already have been denied um, by again the prior board, but they can come in, make their make their case to you guys. And you take it under advisement in one way or the other. Um, your response will come in time for them to still be able to file timely at the appellate tax board should they choose to do that. Should we schedule out the next two Thursday mornings if they're available for the next two meetings that you indicate you might need? You could do that. Does that yeah, work for your schedule, Chef? I mean, yeah, I, yeah, I, I think, think so. Mike, does that work? I'm double checking okay. right now. Um, Thursday morning at nine is a good time for you know it's good time for me. When somebody comes in, say they uh, they they want to come in and meet with the with the assessors, do they come in with legal representation or usually just themselves? It's just themselves. Not that it has happened. Okay. Um, but not very often. It's okay. it's usually informal. Okay. May eleventh is out. Me. That's the second Thursday. And no, we're talking about two Thursdays from today. Twenty-seven. So, oh, April okay. Twenty-seven and May fourth. Okay, April twenty-seven. Um, I have an eight a.m. doctor's appointment, um, but I should be out. Uh, I might be a little late, but doubtful. We'll make it nine thirty. Can we make it nine thirty? Yeah. Like? yeah. yeah. Oh, would that be better? Ten o'clock? Would that work better? Well, it'd be safer. As long as the rooms are available, right? Want to try ten on the that's the twenty seventh or the fourth or both? I don't care. Um, I'm I'm easy. What works for you guys? Well, okay. I want you to be able to clear your appointment. Yes, that's, yes. Yeah. So so on the fourth, no, the twenty seventh, we're looking at ten o'clock. Okay, if that's okay. Yeah, uh, assessor. Now the four. Should we go back to nine? Yeah. You said you like nine. How about nine thirty? Um, that work for you? I mean, I'm fine at nine, but yeah, nine, is fine. nine would work better because I hate to say this, I'm in the middle of boat season. So <laughs> okay, um, okay, I'm getting it ready. Okay, if that's all right. So nine eight. So ten o'clock on the twenty seventh, and nine a.m. on the fourth. And if you average that, that's 9.30. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> but you have to meet so I'll be here at 9.30 both of those days. You have to meet in the middle of the week. <laughs> so that's fourth. That's 10. Um, how long do you want to reserve? I'd say an hour. I mean, I, I really don't. I mean, we can fill up the time because we can always talk about other issues. But yeah. Just do you want to do an hour? Yeah, I'd say an hour. So it's, uh, we, may, we may not have anything to do. And that's fine because, yeah. I mean, I'd like nothing more than to sit here and just, you know, talk about, yeah. you know, 
elements of this. Because uh, right now, when I speak with people, step up, you know, it's like, you know, we go to a barbecue, if you cook really exceptional food, that improves the value of your property. Yes, <laughs> right. But if you uh, give me the exceptional food to take home, it lowers the value of your property. And then, and then, you know, all the people that said to me, um, you know, I'll vote for you, you lower my tax. I'm sure. And then I had people that said, I'm fine if you raise my tax. I'm like, okay, so you're in the raise taxes bucket, you're in the lower taxes bucket, and then there's a bucket of people that are fine with what they're paying. Yeah. It's like, okay, that's the biggest one. This is a bucket of like, right. So if we get enough people that want their taxes raised, they want. You also have the option on your state taxes, you have the option mm. to pay the 5.85 or whatever it is. Or whatever, right. Or give yeah. an extra donation, I think. No, no, you have no. A, an option to pay instead of uh, 5% percentage. to use a 5.85 okay. multiplier. Okay. I mean, I'm not sure. He fixed one thing. Yeah. Okay, so we all sat on the 27th and the 4th. Looks like 20. Oh, you're checking it right here. Two. Yeah. Isn't 27th the 4th? Do we know how many people are on right now on our meeting? Um, right now, there's no one. Is there ever anybody? No. Just. I mean, not since I was on last week. It's um, or it is, I was on yeah, the past past yeah. few weeks. Yeah. The recordings are all posted, so I don't, I don't yeah, know that's fine. what, um, you know, how many people watch it. There's, we can actually find out. I just don't know. Yeah, I think there is a, somebody who keeps the stats on who watches it. Yeah. But um, no, we've never, I don't think we've ever had anybody on the meeting. Yeah. All right. Well, the room's available at 10. I'm going to assume the room is available at 10. On the 27th, and the 27th, and on the 4th at 9. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're checking. Oh, and there is a other person who might be interested in being appointed to the third spot. Oh, uh, Artie is interested. I just he was interested, and also apparently Tom Collar was interested. Oh, Thomas? Yeah. Okay. Spoke with him this morning. He was on the board previously. I did, yeah. Oh. Um, Tom's yeah. a good guy. Yeah. I've yeah. talked for years. How do you choose between the two? Well, it's really whichever one of them volunteers to select and select board choice, I guess. I, I right. Well, it's going to be it's the, the combined uh, five members of the select board and the two of us. Yeah. So you've got seven voting members okay. for whoever is. is uh, uh, and Art May has board. just felt he didn't want to leave people in the lurch. You know, Tom said he would consider he I thought he had moved out of town. I know he was considering it because he bought a place, big place in Maine. Yeah. And um, I see the pictures. He's a big hunter. Yeah. And I. Uh, I gave him a ring the other day and he got back to me this morning. Okay. And uh, I said, oh, to move. Well, well mentioned to him that Artie's, you know, because I, well, I yeah. was interested. I, yeah. I spoke with him on election day and he yeah. said, yeah. He said, and I'm like, okay, call it. So he'll. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. So he's already, you know, he should be, have spoken with Marianne or. or okay. Kevin. If he did, that's fine. I just, I just got the impression that he may have just been not wanting to. But I know to that he probably won't get filled until people June. Yeah. Uh, it takes time just to do the project. But again, we're not going to have a lot to do right. at that point right. over the summer anyway. So our last meeting should be May 4th? No. If we have taxpayers who want to talk to you, that would probably, that's generally our last meeting you know, until the fall. May that, 4th. And you know, we'll wait to see if anybody calls, first of all. And if somebody calls, I'll say, okay, let me talk to the board, find a couple of suitable evenings for them, and get back to them. So is it safe to say July and August is off limits? Pretty much, yeah. Unless something dramatic comes up. And okay. I don't really Unless you're going down to your phone, in which case we're going to schedule a meeting. Yeah. <laughs> that we, can have, we can have can Zoom from a boat? Yeah, yeah, we can do Zoom, Zoom, right? Yeah. 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 I'm pretty much good everywhere but Cuddy Hunk, so I can't do okay. Zoom meeting. <laughs> so we're good on room and Zoom. For both days. For, both, uh, for the 27th at 10 and May 4th at 9. Okay. Then that being completed, let's uh, move on to the executive session. And Melissa, do you want to make the motion? Uh, I will, or at least tell me what the motion is to for 
to go into executive session. So the motion that you're looking for is to enter into executive session to comply with the provisions of any general or special law, specifically to discuss real estate and personal property exemption and or abatement applications, which are not open to public inspection for Mass General Law, Chapter 59, Section 60, the result of any decisions made to be announced at the next meeting provided such announcement is consistent with the applicable statutes and not to return to open session afterward. So, so moved. Second. Uh, Mike. Aye. John. Aye. Uh, we're in executive session. And we we'll just need to turn off the Zoom and close the door. That'll be good. So, um, one second.